Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Bristol. We are here with Timberland dog sledding. Dog sledding during the summer. Absolutely. Unheard of. Absolutely. I'm joined by Ray. He is the founder and owner yes. of uh, Pure Life Adventures. Yeah. Now, I think it's really interesting that not only do you offer canoeing and navigation, which we'll get into a little bit later in the show, but you've actually teamed up with Timberland to offer year-round dog sledding. Absolutely. Yeah, for sure. Uh, yeah, so we do Pure Life Adventures. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of outdoor guiding, right. but I don't have 50 years of racing experience. I don't have a yard of 40 dogs. Yeah. Uh, however, Denny does. <laughs> so that's kind of how the, uh, how the part partnership works out. Uh, we each have our own expertise and, and we, we give a good product out to the out to customers. Absolutely. And what made you think that people would want to do year round dog sledding? I mean, I didn't even actually realize that summer dog sledding during the summer existed. It's interesting. Actually, uh, most people don't think of it. Most people think really dog sledding in the summer. <laughs> uh, but if you think about it, any athletes, you can't expect these dogs to uh, uh, to be to get in shape and perform all within about 15 weeks of winter it just right. doesn't happen so they have to be exercised all the time anyways this is a way to exercise them and uh, and we have a lot of parties and, and mm -hmm. things here as well so. absolutely and you can plan a couple day experience with pure life that will not only include that canoeing and the and the navigational instruction but also you can do some dog sledding. Get over here, Denny. <laughs> he is the owner of uh, Timberland Dog Sledding. Thank you so much for having us today. You're very welcome. Pleasure. This, oh, this is amazing. How did you get into dog sledding? Oh, that's a long story. <laughs> My mother had sled dogs, so uh, I was raised with sled dogs. Yeah. I was a kid. I used to watch my cousin racing. Yeah. So then I had a dream to one day maybe my father only allowed me to have one dog. So I said someday I will have more. So I do have now. Yeah, you've got a few. Both. Yeah, we have 38 dogs at Timberland. Mm -hmm. Yes. And uh, where did the idea come from to offer dog sledding during the summer? Well, I seen a magazine that they have that before in, in Alaska. They have yeah. that in Alaska. And uh, here in Canada, I think I was for maybe one of the first ones that started that, yeah. Absolutely, absolutely, yes. a, a pioneer in the trade. So what can people expect when they come and spend a half day with you here at Timberland dog sledding? Well, uh, it's, uh, most of them are dogs lo lover. Yeah. And then uh, when they get here, like uh, some, uh, they think maybe they're all huskies, but uh, if we would have husky, we couldn't run them like we run them there. there. It's, That's what I was expecting, yeah. huskies. Yeah. What types of dogs are these? Well, those they call them Euro dogs. Okay. Because okay. it's a mix of uh, a pointer, yep. German pointer, mm -hmm. greyhound, and a little bit of Alaskan husky. Right. Not made by me. Norwegian made that. Okay. It comes from the, the the base comes from Norway. Okay. Best sled dogs I ever had. So. So when you come to do the half day experience with Timberland, you'll not only um, get a chance to take a peek at the museum, but you also actually are very hands on with the dogs. We, uh, as you saw just before the commercial break there, we actually uh, wrangled all of the dogs up here and they're all lined up and ready to go. So what do you think, gentlemen? Shall we uh, get the dogs hooked up and uh, show these people what it's like to do dog sledding Absolutely. in the excited. heart of Bristol in the month of August? Perfect. Let's do it. Let's yes. do it. Yes, let's go. <laughs> That was amazing. <laughs> I have never experienced anything like that. Head to their website and check out all of the information. I can only imagine what dog sledding is going to be like in the winter time. Thank you so much. We've got lots more coming up. Don't go anywhere.